subscribe button, turn on for the sake of check. Before I start this video, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, stay up to date with all my motherfucking videos. Follow me on all my social media, will be in the description box below. Give the video a thumbs up, does it cause you guys a fucking penny, helps the channel out. Really appreciate if you hit the thumbs up button. I also have a Weeble fill link and an Amazon affiliate link. All my affiliate links are in the description box below. Let's get to the review today. Shout outs to Adam for sending over Physique's Golden Bar. Yay. Get some thumbnail. Let me get some old school thumbnail action. Boom. There it is. Old school thumbnail. All right, before I get into it, let's open up the sponsored drink of the day. Whole lot of chocolate. Bang, I love this flavor, man. I don't know why, but these unique flavors from Bang, I really like. A lot of people don't like them. Birthday cake and Tootsie Roll? Are you kidding me? Those are, those are like, one of my, that's birthday cake and Tootsie Roll, Radical Skedaddle, Purple Kittles, those are all in my top five, probably. I'd have to think about it, because they have a shit ton of flavors, but you know what I'm saying. I, it, I love it. Mm. Ooh, that's good. Tastes like chocolate. For those of you who don't know, I don't put them in the refrigerator sometimes, a lot of the times, and I'm usually on the go. So I grab my cup, put some ice in it, and then I just drink it. All right, anyways, let's get to the review. Sh 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 Physique's Golden Bar. It looks like it's a competitor version of like an outright bar. So let's go and talk about the price point. The price point is $35 on Amazon. If you guys do pick these up, use my Amazon affiliate link, by the way. All right? Anyways, let's look at the macros. One bar, 241 calories, 12 fat, 3 saturated fat, 23 carbs, 2 fiber, 10 sugar, 18 grams of protein. All right, the ingredients, I'm going to put that up for you so you guys can see that. And that's the ingredients. All right, let's go ahead and look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Look at that clean B-roll. I'm going to put that, put the B-roll in. All right, so you guys can see the B-roll. Look how clean the label is. Yeah, it's clean. Look how clean that is. It's clean. Yes, I like the Hodge Twins, all right? If you guys are new to the channel or, like, come across this video, you're like, he sounds like the Hodge Twins. I do have some Hodge Twins influence, for sure. But I'm still my fucking self, you know what I'm saying? So, it's kind of like when you, when you listen to a band... You know, you tend to hear other influences when you listen to that band. It doesn't mean that they're not original. It doesn't mean that they're not good. They just tend to have influences. So, anyways, let's get to the review. You guys don't want to hear me bullshitting in the car. Maybe you do. All right, it looks like an outright bar, but, like, more based around oatmeal or something. Boom. Let's go and try it out. Taste this. Oh, fuck So, my first initial thought was, this thing's hard as a fucking brick. Super hard once you try to bite into it. Once you bite into it, there's a little bit of crispies in there. It's getting like a little bit of crispy crunchy. I'm not completely sold on this, like... Very hard texture. Like, what the fuck? You know? If you're going to come out with a bar that's similar to that outright, that's more expensive and doesn't offer anything, it's hard. The taste is just like, it's okay. It's nothing to write home about, though. If this was $35, which it is, 
And it tastes exactly like an outright bar. I would tell you still, get an outright bar or an authentic bar. Either one. I love those bars. They're the same price, similar price. I don't understand this. Why would they come up with this bullshit? It's okay. But I, I'm not I'm not jumping up and down about it. Thank God I got only one bar from Adam. I hope he didn't buy a bowl, whole box. I, I hope he didn't. If he did, you can always fix these with a microwave because they're hard as shit. You can fix it with a microwave. Microwave fixes a lot of things that I don't like. There's a lot of times where I'll review something and I'm like, man, this isn't that great. Pop in the microwave. It bumps it up about maybe one, maybe 1 1.5. It tends to make things way better. This is one of those instances. It's not bad by itself, but it'd be way better in the microwave and it's super hard and it would be softened up in the microwave. Not bad as far as ratings. I think I'm going to throw this in the 7.75 category. And I'll tell you why. If, if the texture was more on point, I'd probably throw it in like the 8.25 category. Maybe 8.5 if it was super soft and everything. But this texture is really throwing me off and really giving me like the, I got to scale it down a little bit. You know what I'm saying? The taste is pretty good, but it's it's not, it's not amazing. Like it's not knocking my socks off. So you throw the taste in with the texture. I got to give this a 7.75 guys. Not terrible though. I don't think anyone's going to eat this and be like, this thing isn't good. It's just the texture because it's super hard. So that's my thoughts. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys try this video, if you guys try those out, let me know what the fuck you think in the comment section below. Other than that, we're progressing and we're regressing. And other than that, I'll check you guys later. Yay. Yeah.